this trip, I'm out with the Air Force Texan in 357 on an end of season deer hunt. Before heading down to the Salt Fork Ranch, I stopped by Air Guns of Texas to pick up guns, gear, and air. And some of the devastator bullets being produced there. The Al Clark Devastator Bullet was purpose built for the Air Force Texan 357. These bullets are well packaged and are consistent and uniform in manufacture. It's a 128 grain 358 hollow point bullet. Then back to the ranch. I've been hunting here a fair bit this year. It was very wet and muddy as I drove in. The Texan is a solid performer on big game with a combination of accuracy, power, and flexibility with power adjustments to optimize for specific applications and bullets. This is the air gunner's version of hand loading. I got my gear together and aired up. I filled the gun up to 3200 PSI, threw the rifle in my pack scabbard and was off. Did I mention it was also cold? It was about a half mile to hike to the blind. I wanted to leave the area undisturbed, plus it was a muddy mess on the way to the old wooden blind. I pushed a big hog in the brush on the way in, but I didn't get a shot before he was off. A couple does came in to feed. I'd thrown some corn on the ground to pull the deer away from the feeders. When the bigger of the two gave me a broadside, I took it. A little higher than I wanted, but a solid hit. The deer ran about 25 to 30 yards and piled up. She was dead when I walked up a few minutes later. We ran about, I guess, 25 yards, jumped the fence, and then dropped right here. I've got to get her gutted, field dressed, and down to the processor. Passed on a couple of bucks and. Uh, uh, in the end, didn't get the buck I wanted, but I wanted to get deer in Texas uh, with an air gun. And so uh, this is it for me. Nice dose, you're gonna get in the freezer.